Hi everyone, I'm Melissa Gunderson with a few of this Thursday morning's top trends. We're going to start with some local news. The hashtags Ballpark and Southwest are both trending locally as the Chihuahua's home is named Ballpark of the Year by the website BaseballParks.com. But this morning, people are talking about the Chihuahuas for a whole different reason. Player Cody Decker was on the Oberman Show last night on ESPN2. He was chatting with none other than the host, Keith Olbermann, and they talked special ballpark bark in the park jerseys. Olbermann mentioned that those jerseys were auctioned off for charity. Decker said that while the final numbers aren't in yet, he believes that so far they've raised about $13,000. But perhaps some of the most exciting news came after that announcement. So as I said, when you when you arrange this, I'll donate too. We'll get the final number in, but I'll match it. And we'll give like half to the Thank Humane so Society much. in El Paso and then half to like a no-kill shelter. Great news there. That's making many El Pasoans very excited and proud this morning and rightfully so. Now switching topics here. If you like a good laugh, get ready because there's a YouTube account called Barack's Dubs that's taking random words from the president's speeches and putting them together to create parodies of hit songs. The latest one is Fancy by Iggy. Things first. I'm the realist. Realist. Drop. Right. And the whole world. Feel it. Feel it. And I'm still in the murder business. I couldn't hold you down. Like I'm giving lessons in physics. The video was posted Tuesday and it already has more than a million and a half views. The creators of this video have also made other very similar videos. For example, they have Obama singing, Call Me Maybe, <laughs> which has more than 42 million views. And another favorite, I'm sexy and I know it. <laughs> I definitely recommend going online and checking those out because they are so very funny and he does a better job than I just did there. So, okay, speaking of music, also on the trending list this morning, one fan went to a bar, knocked back a few too many, and then wrote an online petition urging the NFL to let Weird Al Yankovic headline the halftime show for the Super Bowl. The petition posted on change.org already has thousands of signatures, so clearly some people think it's a good idea. Others, on the other hand, think it's going to take a miracle for that to happen. For more trending topics, tune into the KFOX 14 Morning News weekdays from 5 to 8 a.m. And also, if you have an opinion on any of the topics that I mention either on the show or here in this vlog, let me know by posting your thoughts onto Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. Just remember to use the hashtag KFOX14Social in your post.